Brits are renowned for their sarcastic sense of humour and here in this country we love a good provocative debate. So you would think that free speech would be protected and we'd be able to shout our opinions from the rooftops, right? Wrong. There's a whole raft of legislation which stops you saying what you believe in. Uh, we don't have freedom of speech anymore. And one piece of law in particular is at issue, Section 5 of the Public Order Act. One little clause that's causing big problems. What this law has been used for is two particular ways. Firstly, to stifle inconvenient political views. So views which are against Islam, views which are against Christianity, views which are against the equality of homosexuals. So people who say that sort of stuff can be arrested. The second way it's been used is by the police, and they use it as a sort of catch-all to arrest you if, the, if everything else fails. Those who've been caught out include someone who insulted Scientology by calling it a dangerous cult, and wait for it, someone who called a police horse gay. <laughs> Under Section 5 of the Public Order Act, there's no requirement to prove that the person intended any negative consequences from something they said or did, and it only has to be likely to have caused offence. So I could be prosecuted for saying or doing something, even if no one was actually offended. Whilst the horse probably got over it pretty quickly, those on the receiving end of this law have had to live with the consequences. Protracted court cases, many of which are eventually thrown out at appeal, but not before costing the taxpayer a pretty penny. I'd been a victim too uh, when I protested against Islamist extremists who were advocating killing gay people and women who have sex outside of marriage. I was prosecuted for this uh, alleged crime of insult. Um, really in a free society, insults are not nice but they shouldn't be criminal offences. When it comes to defending free speech, many feel what we're actually talking about is protecting our right to offend. It's the essence of democracy. The essence of democracy isn't people wandering around saying flopsy bunnies, flopsy bunnies and smiling at one another. It's about informed debate about a whole range of issues and nothing should be off limits. The increasingly bizarre cases where the Section 5 law is being used have led to a huge public outcry and a campaign to get the law changed. The Minister, Damien Green, the Policing Minister, said on the 17th of September that he'll be responding in due course. We would normally have expected the government to have responded by now, so I sincerely hope that there will be a change imminently. Whether it hurts people or it insults people, speech must be free. It's the fact that so many people in this country believe that, that we've seen such a fierce fight defending our rights to say whatever we want, whenever the luck we want to. Sarah Firth, RT, London.